Hey everyone, today we're taking our 2012 Acura MDX on a road trip. So we're going four hours to Chicago and it's the first time that we're taking our second car on a road trip. So in this video, I'll be filming hacking us up and I'm gonna show you what features we're gonna use inside the car. So we are also bringing our kitty along so that's why we have some kitty litter right there. Yeah, it's very exciting. Normally we would take our first car, which in this case would be our 2023 MDX. But since we're going to Chicago and Chicago is not the safest place for cool cars that stand out, we decided to take our second car, our older MDX. So let's get started packing up. So first I'm going to start with all of the things that would go in the false bottom. Um, here's the false bottom. Maybe not the cleanest, but hey, we have to use it. I'm just gonna take this out so I don't have to hold it up the whole time. Let's get started. So let me find something that would fit in the false bottom. Okay. Um, Maybe block us in telestrations. Let's see. Yep. That would fit. Uh, let's see if the block us will fit with it. Yep. So, okay, I forgot. I put the lid right there. That looks like uh, that's about it. So I'm going to take the lid and put it back. It can be a little bit hard to do while holding a camera. There we go. Um, so we're also going to use this seat right here for extra storage. Because no one's sitting here, but there are two people that are going to sit in the third row. So we have to be mindful of that and let them get in first. But we're gonna go in like an hour, so I'm just packing it up early. Now here's our huge suitcase. Uh, there are a lot of things leaning on it right now. We'll just have to take it away and see what happens. Yep, I knew that would happen. So this suitcase cannot fit flat. So what we're going to have to do is tilt it on the side. Uh, I will have to put the camera down because it's really awkward to Put in with right. one. Our big suitcase barely fits. So, um, this is the latch where the trunk will close. Let's see if the trunk will close. Okay. It's not closing. So, that tells me we may have to put it in the second row. Um, okay. Let me see what I can do before we jump to conclusions like that. Let's see if it'll close with the power operating function. It'll just beep three times if it can. Yeah. Just what I thought. So it can't do it. We're going to have to take it out and put other stuff. All right, so we have a lot of other stuff to pack back in here. Uh, I think this is all of the stuff we're bringing. Uh, luckily, we do have this carry-on suitcase that will fit. So let's just shove it back here and the trunk will close. And let's see, it's not opening or anything. So the trunk is securely closed with that carry-on suitcase there. I am bringing my tripod because, uh, spoiler alert, I will be reviewing a 2023 Honda Odyssey there. Um, I'll put this in the second row. Let's see. Next off, we're going to put the snack bag in the third row. Because uh, mom will be sitting in the third row with my sister. And they'll, um, they always have the snack bag back here. This is my younger sister, by the way. I'm the oldest in my family. It's pretty fun. All right, so that's where 
Máme syringu. Um, she'll just find it, sit on it, and smash all of our snacks. Or she'll just take it and have it on her lap. Okay. So, see any smaller things that might be able to fit in that cubby? Um, let's see. We could try um, one of the bags here. Alright, so that's about how it will go. We will have to stack things up. Here's my beloved remote controlled car. I am making a video that is going to review this. I haven't posted it yet. I filmed it like a month ago. Um, but I have been too busy with other cars to post it. I promise it will be on YouTube soon enough. So here's my remote control car. I might pack it in later. Or on second thought, we might pack it in now. So since this is such a flimsy box, I will have to put the camera down again. So All right, hold so on. I've got it in. It would not fit here. The wheels were sticking out a little bit. So I could put it on top. Um, fits well. Let's just see. Okay, so barely. There it is right there. And let me um, load some more things in here. So next off we have this bag. Put that there. If you want to fast forward, um, you may. Because uh, after we pack up, I'll show you what we're going to use inside our car. We only have a little bit of space left in the trunk. So we're going to have to see what we can do. Um, there's no room for the tripod. There is room for this coupon bag. Hmm. This is the stuff we have left to put in the second row. Does not look like we can fit it in the trunk. So, let's see if the trunk will close. It is power operated. Okay, two clicks. That means the trunk has officially closed. That's a good thing, by the way. So, of course, we probably would have fit more stuff if we took this car, but really, who wants their car to be stolen? Not us, so we're going to take our second car. Now, let's see what we can fit in the second row. So, here we've got the door open. I'm gonna put in my tripod first, so let's just fold it up, like so. And then I'll stick it in here. Okay, now let's see if the suitcase can fit. I will be putting down the camera, so right, hold so on. The suitcase will not fit uh, on the floor. I did try to move my front seat back, or forward, I mean. I'm probably going to move it back to the position that it was at. Okay, let's see. Is that it? All right, so that should be it. Uh, so I guess I'll just have to pack this one in later because still we've got people, two people sitting in the third row and we have to make space for them to get in. So we'll save this suitcase for right, So I took out the suitcase. We can't fit it in. So we're left with the other snack bag that's for breakfast and the kitty litter. So let's see. Um, my brother will be sitting here. So I have to put the tripod. Um, let's see if I can shrink the tripod. You can't shrink it with one hand. But uh, let me see if I can move this over to the um, 
center area. Okay, so it looks like I can. And my brother will still have enough room. His feet can't touch the floor, so, you know, he should be good. I really hope that bag doesn't get dirty. It's a really nice one. And now for the kitty litter. Since this one is heavy, I don't want to risk dropping it. So I'll have to put the camera down again. Um, but I'll have to find a place to put it in the second room. All right, so I did find a good place for the tripod. Uh, it's in the trunk. I don't want to wait for the trunk to close, so I'll just do it manually. And yeah, it's not opening. Uh, we will have to check in here to see uh, if anything will spill out once we get the trunk. And I also found a good place for both of these bags. Um, better than I expected, actually. So, it's not all the stuff we have to bring. Um, we do also have that suitcase. And look, I put them in such a way that my brother had room, and there was room to collapse the seat and push it forward. So, now we just have to put the suitcase in. I will have to wait until later to put that in because my sister and my mom will have to get back here. So, let's start on the driver's side now. So this is where my dad will be sitting. Um, we will be using every piece of storage that there is. So we will be using this stuff down here. No other storage in the door. Um, seats are comfortable, 10-way power adjusting. He is my only seat too. All right, so no head-up display. This is, after all, the base model. Um, mirrors are adjusted to how he wants them. Uh, manual parking brake. Steering is heavy, but um, we appreciate that on the highway. And, yeah, I think it'll be a nice place. He doesn't really need his seat warmer on. Um, we'll also be using those two cup holders and this storage space there. And here comes the garbage man. Uh, yeah, pretty straightforward. Uh, phone charger right there. That's probably where, um, actually this is where you put his phone. We don't have Android Auto in here, so he'll have to put his phone right there. You also have the... Where did that go? Uh, this is for your aux jack. You will be listening to some music, or we could just listen to FM radio. Yep, that's about it. We will also be using the moonroof, but not now. Let's go on the passenger side. Alright, before we get on the passenger side, I want to uh, say what's going to hurt us on the road trip. These tires. Kamho Krukin HP71. So, although you're saying, like, mm, what's wrong with them? I have Kamho's on my car. These tires are super noisy, especially on the uh, driver's right side. We got the alignment fixed, we got the tires rotated. We don't know what's wrong with it, but once they turn right, it makes a very unpleasant tire noise. So, it's good to get some miles on these. We're also trying to take the turns fast so we can wear out the tires quicker. All right, passenger time. Uh, I won't need the storage as much. Uh, I will have this area down here in case I wanna put a small bottle there or maybe some extra storage, you can close it up. And you see, I can't open it, but you have to push the button in and then open it. I brought my sunglasses in here. Um, I usually keep it in our white car, but they're here. Here's my um, sun visor. And you have a mirror here. 
So, yeah. Pretty nice. My brother will be sitting in the second row by himself over here. He doesn't care. Uh, we will be holding his water bottle. I will be holding his water bottle. But, yeah. Seat pocket, he doesn't need that. Oh, th those are my own sunglasses. I should get those out sometime. Uh, he doesn't really need this. Sometimes takes the seat. But he'll be fine. Now for the third row. Let's see. Alright, there we go. So again, not a lot of room back here. Uh, yeah, I am dreading going in here. My sister is short. My mom is not very tall. No offense, mom. If you're watching this. Yeah. Not good for me. I am taller than my mom. Uh, yeah, they don't have a phone charger. Um, that was one of the advantages of bringing our new car. It had a USB port back here. But yeah, only a cup holder and a little tray. And that's about it. So, now, let's get back outside. Okay. Alright, so we're all packed up. Now it's time to bring our MDX on a road trip. And once we reach Chicago at a rental house, I will be unpacking it too. Let's start driving. Hey guys, and welcome back to Cat Conversations. Today we're taking Katarina on a four hour road trip to Chicago, Illinois. So yeah, this is Kitty's second road trip. Uh, she went to Grand Haven with us and she smelled all of the different smells of the pets that have been there. So yeah, we're going to take her on a trip once again. So, we've got some of her stuff. Here's her disposable litter box here. Um, we've got her litter. Um, it's kind of heavy. So yeah, let's get her packed up and ready to go. got here safely thank you for watching this video i just noticed that there's another accurate mdx on the street also um thank you again for watching this video and yeah we've got settled into chicago thanks for watching and i'll see you next time